Hey everyone, this is Sakshi and I heartily welcome you all to Books with Sakshi. I really hope you are doing great and reading some amazing books. In today's video, I am going to review a book and it was an interesting book. It is also first in the series and the title of the book is Adventures with an Interdimensional Psychopath Introduction to Madness which is written by author Wayne Keeler. To start with the basic details, the book is 300 plus pages long but it gets interesting after some time. It's only in the beginning that you need to pay a lot of attention to get the grip of the story but it's definitely interesting here and there and it also has some colourful pictures included which makes the book even more special because personally I love reading books with illustrations and what more can be better than colourful illustrations. So I definitely loved uh, the edition of those colourful graphics in the book. So this is quite an interesting story but it took me some time to get the grip of the story and what is happening and I'll try to break these things into simple points for you guys to understand and just get a gist of what this book is about and then read it if you would be interested. It's a story about Lily Extravagant and uh, she's leading a very very miserable life you can say. She usually remains sad and depressed because everyone just looks down upon her and no one treats her well and she is under the control of people especially in the family. But one day when she comes across a man who looks rather strange in his outfit, uh, her world changes right from there. And the most strange thing that Lily gets to know is that this person actually knows magic and that is why her worlds turn upside down. Lily also loses the person who cared the most about her and she was almost about to get killed but she was saved by Webjack. Lily is offered a new chance at job as well as a new chance in life by Webjack. He tells her to become an interdimensional dweller. Lily is very confused about everything as she doesn't have any idea about all these things about multiple dimensions, about other beings, about gods and stuff. So she is very thrilled as well as at the same time very nervous. But with Webjack by her side, she is very thrilled to learn new things and she has already started with her training, she is learning magic and as whatever is required, she is training herself to do just that. Now the main question that comes in the story is, this Fabajak is actually known for being a monster, a freak as well as a mass murderer. And now Lily trusts this friend so much but her trust is going to be tested upon time and again. But the thing which you have to see is what Lily will actually believe in and what is the reality anyway. So for that you have to read the book and discover it yourself. Now coming to other details about the book, as I initially mentioned, this book gets better at some point but I had this thing with this book that you know at some points I loved it then it became a little monotonous for me then again something happened which really made me curious and I started feeling interested again and then something used to put me off. So this was like you know on and off relationship which I had with this book like sometimes I was interested in uh, the narration and sometimes I just lost my interest simply. So I think this could be a little more smooth and something that you know is very smooth throughout so the readers do not have to make that special and extra effort to pay attention and try to understand whatever is happening in the book. So as this is just the first book I am really hoping other books in the series are going to be smooth and they will be engaging and they will be unputdownable for sure. Lastly, I guess a little more focus could be done on building the characters properly and um, and lastly I feel a little more focus could be done on building the characters properly because I guess that's like the foundation of any book but apart from that everything was fine according to me and a decent attempt by the author considering it's his uh, first book. And I'm definitely waiting for more books to come in the series and read them as well and I'm hoping to have a smoother experience in those books. 
I'll add the book link in the description box. So if you would be interested in reading this book, then definitely go ahead and check that link in the description box. If you're watching this on YouTube and if you're watching this on Instagram, then make sure you watch the profile of the author. I'm also going to tag him in the caption. So you check out the profile of the author and from there you will find necessary links to reach the book. And that is it. I'll see you in the upcoming videos. Until next time, take care and keep reading.